listen, y'all, we want to praise God and thank God for you all being here right now. Uh, we are here for a church in the car. Church in the car. And one of the things that we're using is show love. Show love. Amen. Amen. And so we know that the world needs more love. Would you agree? Amen. 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 So uh, we want to thank God for uh, Rhythm and Soul Band behind us. Let's give them a hand, you all. Amen. That's going to be uh, back me up on these tracks. And so let's go ahead and get started. We want to thank you once again. Our church is uh, Kingdom of Heaven Assembly, known as the Koha Center, um, located at 649 Price Avenue. Uh, services normally on Sunday at 1 o'clock p.m. I'm the pastor, Apostle John W. Rose, senior pastor, um, assistant pastors, Elder Donna Campbell, of course, they are out of town this weekend, amen, but amen. So we thank God for Elder Donna and Deacon James as well. And so we want to, um, once again, um, begin to share some songs with you and just to minister unto you. Also, thank God for First Lady Linda, amen, 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 for yourself for us singing as well and we're going to bring up um, associate pastor pastor uh, rose pivot um will come down to assist us today so we thank god for us she's going to lead us in the word of prayer Heavenly Father, we thank you for this day, oh God. We just ask, Father, Lord, that your anointing, God, will fall fresh upon us, Lord, and that your presence will permeate the atmosphere, oh God, in this place, oh God. We lift you up, we glorify you, and we exalt you, Lord God, and we ask that your song will go out, Lord God, and minister to your people, Lord God, that it may bring forth the change, Lord God, that we need in our lives on today. We just lift you up and glorify you. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. Thank you. 
Oftentimes we go through life, we go through some trials, tribulations, or sometimes we go through failures, and, and sometimes we feel like that we're not good enough because of our past or what, what, whatever it may be. Yeah. But, you know, the, the Word of God tells us that the gifts, gifts and callings of God are without repentance. What does that simply say? That simply means that, listen... The gift that God has placed inside of you, it will always be there. Let me say that again. The gift that God has placed inside of you, it will always be there. Amen. Amen. It's up to you to be activated or to activate it and to go forth in the Lord. Amen. 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 So this particular song is God's call. Everybody say God's call. God's call. Oh yeah, there is a calling of your life. And no matter what you're going through or what you're faced with, you've got to fulfill that call. For the gifts and calling of God are without repentance. That calling on your life will always be there. So rise up in the name of Jesus. Stand tall and stand tall. God's call, God's call. Stand tall, stand tall. Rise up, rise up. You won't fall. Accountable for what you do and say. This is so important. What you gotta break? 
Don't worry, or complain, or be insane. Walk in God's word. Put it in Jesus' name. God loves you, knows what you're going through. So repeat these words, because these words are for you. God's call. God's call. Stand tall. Stand tall. Rise up. Rise up. Amen. I don't know about y'all, but 
I've, I've tried many things and they didn't fulfill me, amen? amen? But it wasn't until I tried, really tried my Lord and Savior Jesus Christ that he changed my life. Amen. And then I began to live a fulfilled life, amen? amen. And so, you know, sometimes people think that, you know, it's a boring life to know Jesus. But I'm here to tell you, it's not boring at all. Amen. Matter of fact, it's exciting. Matter of fact, God begins to do things that you never even thought that he would do. Amen. Amen. A good do in your life. The only thing he's asking for you to do, amen, is seek him first. But seek ye first the kingdom of God and his righteousness and what? And all these things shall be added unto thee. So let's go ahead with this song. This next song is the way, the truth, and the life. He died for our sins and he rose that we may have life and life more abundantly. He is the way, the truth, and the life. Now I'm the person who try not to judge Cause I don't wanna see my face fall in the mud Try my best to run this race without disgrace For the human race as I stand firmly face to face As a matter of fact, with the one who teach me With the one who feeds me, with the one who leads me With this word the spirit alone Shall not take his people home For man shall not get right bread alone So prepare yourself for more For what you're about to hear see Take the key, turn it gently And just walk through the door it's a mission, 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 The way that you do the life, no one comes to the Father except my right. Child 14, 6 chefs like Jerry, humble soul of the first sight. Where there's no vision, no people shall perish. This is how my body goes on the soul of the parents. J.H.U.S. is the way, the truth, and the light. No one comes to the Father except by Christ. J.H.U.S. is the way, the truth, and the light. Now, what a truth of this life. Jesus is the light. Come on now, J.S. Ray is the way, the truth, and the life. No one comes to the Father except by Christ. Come on now, J.S. Ray is the way, the truth, and the life. No one of you confess that Jesus is the light. Come on now, J.S. Ray is the way, the truth, and the life. No one of you confess that Jesus is the light. Come on now, J.S. Ray is the way, the truth, and the life. Let's give God a hand of praise, everybody. Yeah, Jesus is the way, the truth, and the life. Amen. This next song we're going to bring to you. Amen. It's a song. I call it an invitational song. And it's an invitational song, I'd say, for the hard people. Um... How many of y'all remember Gangsta Rap back in the day? <laughs> gangsta Rap. And, and, you know, when it, they call it Gangsta Rap because they come hard. You know, they don't hold anything back. And so, as I, you know, was growing up, you know, um, I, this, I created this, wrote this song in my college days. And um, I'm telling my age now, y'all. <laughs> but as I began to think about you know, what is it that we could say 
to get people to turn their lives back over to Christ. Amen. And you know, God wants us to turn our lives over to Him completely. You know, First Peter, it, it tells us, 3 and I, I believe that, that judgment must begin at the house of God. Yes. And if it first begin at us, what shall the end be of them who do not obey the gospel of God? And if the righteous scarcely be saved, mm -hmm. Where should the ungodly and the sinner man appear? Think about that. If the righteous, those who are living right, yeah, yeah. scarcely make it in, where should the ungodly and the sinner man appear? Yeah. Amen. So we want to bring this song to you. Return to God.
time of the Thank program you. that we say this and maybe something that has been shared with you. And I don't know if you all realize it, but the word of God has been shared with you all throughout the song. Amen. We have scripture after scripture after scripture. But just in case you all, you know, you, they say, hey, you know, there wasn't a scripture given. I'm going to tell you a very simple scripture. It says to humble yourselves under the mighty hand of God that he might exalt you with what? In due time. That means whatever situation that you're going through, that you're faced with, God will exalt you out of that situation. Hallelujah. But it's important for you at this particular moment of your life to make a choice, to decide who will you follow. Will you follow the world or will you follow God? Will you follow the things or will you follow God's word? Will you follow whatever man says or will you follow the Holy Spirit? And so for those of you, amen, who are even joining us by social media, amen, one of the things we want to do is give you this opportunity to say, hey, listen, I'm ready to return back to God. I've been out here. And some of you may have went into a backslidden state when COVID came. And you used COVID as an excuse as to why you backslid. But the truth be told, you were backslidden before COVID hit. You just wanted to use something to hide behind. So this is your opportunity to say, hey, I'm ready to rededicate my life back to the Lord. I'm ready to start my life over again. I want to repent and ask God for forgiveness. If that is you at this moment, amen, we'll just take a couple of minutes. I, I believe that you don't have to pump or prime you. I believe that the Holy Spirit is stirring within your soul. He will cause you to come up and, and rededicate your life. So, Amen. If we can, I know we're in church in the park and there may be people looking at us on social media, but if you're not afraid, if you're not ashamed of the gospel of Jesus Christ, amen, take this moment to come forward. As the band plays, amen, we'll give you just about a minute. someone on even social media who are watching us you say you're ready to rededicate your life to Christ just send up some hearts and we'll get back with you later amen we'll start your
just thank you, God, for all that you're doing right now. We thank you, Lord God, for your love, your grace, and your mercy. We thank you, Lord God, for your try to throw you away. When God begins a good work in you, he'll bring it to pass. Amen. amen. He'll bring it to completion. Amen. The enemy may have tried to do whatever he could early on in your life or even recently to stop you. But he can't stop the plans of God. Amen. He cannot stop the move of God. Just like that first song, that, that first scripture that I share, that the gifts and callings of God are without One of my spiritual mothers, amen. I consider my my uh, first apostle, amen. Apostle Gloria Smith, amen. Spiritual mother, and so thank God for, for coming out, and I really appreciate you, amen. Coming out, Apostle Gloria. Thank God for a few of our friends as well, amen. Deanna and Miss Carol back right there, amen. Thank God for uh, Amira. Amen. He's behind the camera right now. I told the story. I told her. Actually, you know, it's kind of interesting because that the first, the second song. I'm sorry. The song we get ready to sing. <laughs> the song we get ready to sing. Amen. There was a young lady. Um, Y'all might know her. I don't know her name. It's Amira Hawker. Um, who used to be a resident of, of Lexington. But anyway, she's actually singing the background vocals on this particular uh, song. Okay. And, uh, and again, and Amira <laughs> is operating the camera. Amen. Amen. I thought that could be coincidental. Okay. Okay. And then last but not least, uh, amen. Thank God That's for my nice one, beautiful man. wife. Amen. Yeah. And, uh, so girl, she's always there. Thank God for uh, Pastor Rose Freeman, the social pastor. What's the name of the church? Living Faith Worship Center. And, uh, and living Living Faith Worship Center. Amen. Amen. If y'all get a chance to check them out in uh, Winchester. Richmond. I'm sorry, Richmond. <laughs> now I see where my mind is. Richmond, I'm still on the song. What song do you sing next? Richmond. Amen. Try to make it out there. They got anointed a band and actually her, her pastor also is in the band and plays the guitar. Anointed band, you all. Thank God for Rolanda. Amen. And we been putting this on, on, on for years. Amen. And, and uh, great Sean, we call him Sean. Amen. Thank you, Sean. Appreciate it. Amen. You all, y'all get a chance to, I know this is not politics, but you get a chance to vote and you in his district. What district are you in? First district. Vote for Ray Sean Berry. Amen. Amen. And I can say that with confidence. His brother's got a good heart. Every time I see him, amen, he's always got a humble spirit, amen, and a kind word to say. And so I thank you, amen, for supporting this effort too over the years as well. Amen. Let's give our police officer a hand right there. We appreciate you, sir. We appreciate you, amen. Amen. So thank God and thank God for all of our, our guests. And amen. And we got to give it up. For this awesome band, yeah. and that yeah. rhythm and soul band. Yeah. Come on, let's give them a hand. Right. Yeah. Amen. You know, I heard them play, I think it was during mm -hmm. Juneteenth. And um, I wasn't even thinking about it, but Seneca was like, hey, you know, we um, also play for other people, we play for gospel uh, groups as well. And it didn't think, it didn't dawn on me, but then I, I thought to myself, it's like, you know what? I'm going to just 
step out on faith and ask him if he'd be willing to play during this, this particular event. And so, Lord and behold, he got the band together within, what, two, two weeks, two or three weeks, and, and he's here, y'all. So let's give him a hand, y'all. So, real quick, real quick, um, on keyboards we have, Noah Jackson. Come on, let's give it up, y'all. Yeah, Noah. Yeah. Guitar. Silicon Robertson Sr. Silicon Robertson Sr. Come on, let's give him a hand. All right. Pioneer of this group. Bass player. Silicon Robertson Jr. Silicon Robertson Jr. All right. And on drums we have. Trey Booker. Come on, let's give him a hand, y'all. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. John W. Rhodes, uh, senior pop, senior pastor, Pastor John W. Rhodes of Koha, the Koha Center. Amen. And so right now, you all, we're going to share with you this last song called Only What You Do in Christ Your Life. Did you hear that? Did you hear that? I'm so glad, amen, for my, for my help meet. <laughs> Good to remind me, and yes, um, there is a person who is not here that's instrumental for, I believe, at least say about three songs that you're listening to. And probably if I say her name, amen, y'all adore her. Uh, but uh, I've known Teresa ever since college days. We used to go to the same church, um, First Ripley Baptist Church, where, amen, my spiritual dad is uh, Dr. L.A. Newby. Amen. amen. So from First Corinthians Baptist Church, amen, back in the day, uh, Teresa Newby. Come on, let's yeah, give it up for Teresa Newby. Who orchestrated, amen, many of the songs. Um, Show Love uh, was the other one. And then this particular song, Only What You Do in Christ Will Last. Amen. And so thank God for Teresa, uh, amen. And her name is now Acton, Teresa Acton. Amen. amen. So she's out of town, but she would have been here today. Amen. I just wanted to pay my, as we say, respect for those who were instrumental in helping you along the way. Amen. 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 All right. Here we go. Only what you do in Christ will last. Oh, oh, oh. 
Hi, I'm Mr. Mitchell to you, you all. Um, sometime very soon you'll be able to hear uh, all of these tunes. Some, several of them have already been released on the streaming services. But what I'm going to do is for, for some of the old ones like The Way and, and uh, Return to God, they will be released on the streaming services very soon. But you can go to johnwroves.com, johnwroves.com. Right? God bless you.